Now to an inmate transfer that turned deadly in Kansas City. Two sheriff's deputies shot and killed while transporting prisoners to court. ABC's Ariel Reshef is here with what went wrong. Ariel, good morning. Good morning, Dan. Good morning, Paula. That violent takedown happening just outside the juvenile courthouse. Two deputies killed, likely with their own weapons. Police now searching for answers. We heard a pop. It just happened so fast. A deadly ambush just outside a Kansas courthouse. 11:15 a.m. Friday, two officers transporting prisoners for a hearing when they were overcome by an inmate in a gated area next to the building. It is very possible that with their own firearm, they were both shot. 35-year-old deputy Patrick Rohrer, a seven-year veteran of the force, killed. And overnight, 44-year-old deputy Teresa King, who served 13 years, passed away from her injuries in the hospital. The suspect, also wounded in the struggle, rushed into surgery. The courthouse immediately put on lockdown. Somebody from the parking lot started screaming, telling, telling us to run back inside. Shots fired. Get back inside now. The area cordoned off. Doors were locked. We were locked inside of a courtroom. Authorities combing surveillance video for clues about what may have sparked the violent confrontation. This is a courthouse building, so there is video. We will be looking at that video. And as you heard there, the investigation is ongoing. This is the fourth incident in three years where law enforcement officers have been shot in that same county. Police say they are not looking for other suspects at this time. Yes, yeah, some investigation needed in that county. Ariel, thank you very much. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.